Hello everyone, we are from True Maths and in this video we are going to solve question number 8 of exercise 13.2 and the question says spherical glass vessel has a cylinder neck 8 cm long and 2 cm in diameter the diameter of the spherical part is 8.5 cm by measuring the great amount of water it holds a child find its volume to be 345 cm cube. You have to check whether she is correct taking the above as the inside measurements and you have to use the value of pi as 3.1.4. Now it is given that a spherical glass vessel now this is a spherical glass vessel and it has a cylindrical neck this is a spherical a spherical glass vessel and its neck is, is in a shape of cylinder and it is 8 cm long and 2 cm in diameter so the diameter for this is 2 cm so obviously radius will be half of the diameter so radius will be half of 1 which is 1 cm and the diameter of the spherical part is 8.5 cm and if I consider the diameter of this which is 8.5 cm you have to check the amount of water it holds means it will hold the amount of water in that case you have to find the volume of this glass vessel and the volume of this glass vessel will be equals to the volume of this cylinder plus the volume of this sphere okay now if you want to find the volume of this vessel this complete vessel will be equals to the volume of sphere plus the volume of cylinder this I, I think you get clear how this formula is formed now if you know the formula you can substitute here and you will get your answer the volume of this sphere is 4 by 3 pi r uh, here the sphere is bigger consider the radius as r cube plus volume of the cylinder is pi r square h here the radius is small for the cylinder now in both the cases pi is common so I can take pi as common so the value of 4 upon 3 multiplied by r cube plus r square h will remain inside the bracket and pi is taken out value of pi you have to measure as 1.34 this will be 4 upon 3 the radius for the sphere will be the radius is half of the diameter this is capital R and D is given to you as 8.5.2 if I remove this I can place 10 in the denominator this can be cancelled 5 1 times 17 times and 5 2 times so the arc will be equal to 17 upon 4 centimeter so here it will be 17 upon 4 multiplied by 17 upon 4 is multiplied by 17 upon 4 plus here the small r which is the radius of the cylinder is 1 so that will be 1 multiplied by 1 and the height is 8 centimeter now you can cancel this this can be cancelled with this and this will be 17 multiplied by 17 multiplied by 17 this will be 3.14 and this will be 4 into 4 is 16 into 3 is 48 and if I have to multiply 17 with 17 that will be 
Now I have to multiply this with another 17. This will be 9, 8, 2. This will be 3. This will be 4, 9, 1, 3. So this will be 4, 9, 1, 3 plus 8. Now you can further solve this. Either you can cancel this right here and the value this will be added to 8 and that value will be multiplied by 3.14 and the answer will be your volume of this complete vessel. I hope you can uh, calculate this. And at the last, you have to check whether the volume is equals to 3, 4, 5 or not. If the volume is equals to, if the, your volume comes out to be 3, 4, 5, then this child is correct. And if the volume is not equals to 3, 3, 4, 5 centimeter cube, in that case, this child is not correct. So this is how you can find this question. Uh, this calculation can be done. And if you like this video, please subscribe to our channel. And if you have any problem in maths, you can directly contact to us. The phone number, the email address and the WhatsApp number is given below in the description. Thank you.